now we're going to the party after that. I hope Nathan enjoys his last party. Chloe, we can go right to the cops. Yeah. We have proof. We do. Fuck the police. Rachel wanted us to find her. So we could get real justice. Um. And revenge. The Prescotts have had this coming for a hundred years, and nobody is gonna get in my way. Especially with your help. Right? I'm with you to the end, Chloe. You know that. Well, if we're going this route, then we need to maybe approach it and like getting um, Nathan to turn himself in. Let's not do that with the gun. Oh shit! This is like that eclipse. You're right. What? Look at the outline. I can't tell if they're different. What is that? that? Can't be too. Moved. Jesus, Chloe, look up at the sky. Possibly. Beautiful. I don't give a shit. The world is ending. Cool. You're not listening. Something major is going down. That's right. Nathan Prescott is going down. Ooh. Welcome to the end of the world, ladies. I'm glad you decided to escort me. You look really good, Warren. Are you all right after today? I'm glad you stopped me. Nathan is dangerous. Are you drunk? Where is he? I didn't see him at the dorm again. I was held up in my room. Dude, have you been drinking? Well, if you consider half a beer drinking. Let's go, Max. Hey, hey. I know this is a bad time, but can I get one picture? I've been feeling like this might be actually the end of the world, so I want to have something for prosperity. Well, I don't blame you, Warren. I know, I know. I'm pain in the booty. Just one picture. Uh. Action. We've got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. Sorry. I just wanted to feel like a normal student after this week's ultra violence. I never hit anybody like that before. I was always the one getting my ass kicked. Hey, we still need your expert help. If you see Nathan, text me immediately, okay? And do not let him see you. He won't. I know how to be invisible here. Not oh. to me, Warren. Text soon. <sighs> Bros had half a beer. I heard a one can dance, but that's taking the piss. Which he is pissed. He's the drunk as shit. Alrighty, let's get into. Hi, can I take your code or anything? No, I didn't see any tablet with cat pics. Okay, Chloe, where the hell are you? Ugh, I hate touching all these clothes. Uh, hi, Stella. Hey, Max. Welcome to the end of the world. Do you want me to check anything in? Uh, no thanks, Stella. Have you seen Nathan yet? No, thank God. That boy creeps me out. Wait, some girl just asked about Nathan before you came in. Ah, oh, shit. What girl? What girl? She had blue hair, dressed yeah. like a punk. I've seen her putting up those Rachel Amber posters. I'm stuck here, so I'm sorry I can't help you. So why are you working at a Vortex Club party? I didn't think you wanted to be a member. Screw that. I'm here for the job. Who hired you? Who hired you? Mr. Jefferson asked me because he knows I don't have a lot of money, even with my job and scholarship. I'm not cool enough for this school. Yes, you are, Stella. You're smart, honest, and you bust your ass for Blackwell. I hope everything turns out your way in the end. Well, thank you, you Max. I really appreciate that. Hey, your face looks so intense. Are you okay? Uh, no, I'm actually not okay. I, 
I just need to find Nathan. And don't get too close if you see him. Hell no. This is homework, not a party. I'll text you if I spy him. Good luck. Okay. Let's go. Blackwell trauma. It seems like it never ends, huh? This is where it's going to end. For Rachel's sake. Well, if you want to hang out with Brooke and me, we're here for you. Thanks, Daniel. I have to stay on my mission now. I hope you stay on yours and become a great artist. Well, I'll be celebrating someday in a museum next. Adios. Hello, Brooke. Max, I didn't expect to see you at a Vortex Club party. I didn't expect that either, but I really need to find Nathan. Have you? No, I haven't seen him. And I'm not looking for him, so I most likely won't tonight. I just hate that scrub and his club. Then why are you here? So why are you here tonight? No homework? Boredom? Eating? Have you seen Warren tonight? No, but we're going to map out our drive-in date later. I was just talking to Daniel about a road trip next week to the Portland Art Museum. Oh, that is so cool. He needs a friend. I bet Daniel will be a great museum guy. I'm more into science than art, but what kind of a selfish fangirl would miss a Miyazaki exhibition? You're not selfish, Brooke. You're just trying to live your life without all this bullshit. Like all of us here. You seem so wise and kind of invincible this week. I think that snow and eclipse gave you superpowers. <laughs> you Why would you say that? Double leg. Only with your drone. By the way, did you see that crazy double moon out there earlier? Max, if I saw a double moon out there, I would assume it really was the end of the world. Well, the night is still young, Brooke. So are we, Max. So let's plan a drone date next week. No one Drake. seems to know where Nathan is. Drake. Energy drinks, soda, energy drinks. I know somebody has to She did cocaine, but I was like, what the hell? There's Courtney drinking alone without Taylor or Orvin. There's Courtney drinking alone. Whoa, actually, Taylor that's a good point. Where are those guys? I wonder why. I just wish someone looked. I almost didn't see you. Max, you're the only person I don't mind seeing right now. I was looking for Nathan. I've avoided almost everybody here tonight. Uh, why are you looking for Nathan? Uh, no big deal. No big deal. Really? You look pretty fucking intense. Is Nathan bothering you? I have dreams that somebody finally kicks his ass one day. Luke, sometimes dreams come true. Today I saw Warren give Nathan an epic headbutt. Yes, give it up for brother Warren. Now all we have to do is drive all these goddamn Prescott vampires out of town. Vortex. That'll be hard to do when the Prescotts own the town. And the Vortex Club. I call it the Vortex Cult. Look at this crap. Dress code? VIP section? Elitist bullshit. Preach it, brother Luke. <laughs> Okay, I have to get going. Um, thanks for seeing me. No, thank you. For helping Kate. 
And for keeping it real. Keeping it Peace real, out. bro. Bigfoot on otter action. <sighs> I have to stop her getting hit. Angel is stuffed up every single You're welcome. Time. Protect me from the cruel world. Thank you again, Mr. Glass. I feel like I. Should I just. Yeah, I Oh. Fucking you get bouncy, you bitch. Excuse me, but I'm going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Members only. Okay? Sorry, but I'm on the list. Okay? I know that Max Caulfield is not on any list for the Vortex Club. Nice try. Listen! No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. I need to find a way to enter this bullshit so club. the Courtney again. She said she was gonna put me on list. What the fuck, man? Hey, Courtney. How are you? Max, our guest star arrives fashionably late. <laughs> Say bonsoir to the end of the world. Even though you flake on my party makeover, you still get special access to the Vortex Club VIP lounge. You better let your minion know since she is not that. Oh, and that little asshole just made her last mistake. She thinks she's Victoria. <laughs> bye bye. Now, let's go make an official VIP entrance, Max Factor. <laughs> get it? Hey, Sarah, um, do you know that I've personally put Max's name on the list? So, you like decide to block her from coming in while I'm taking a break? <laughs> you're not in charge here. Wait, I, I just... Uh, oh my god, you're done! And you're off the list permanently. Welcome to the Vortex Club. That's what you get for me, the bitch. Let's be through, motherfucker. Nathan is the Vortex Club. So his ass has to be here tonight. Max, look at you go, girl! Taylor, have you seen Nathan yet? She's saying. Talk to you soon, Taylor. No, that's fine by me. He's been getting like too buggy and it's kind of scary. Victoria might know. Who's Victoria? What does Victoria say about him? She blows it off, but Vic is close with me. They're more like brother sister oh. or something. She really cares about him. Is this why you want to be in a vortex club? No, Max. I'm like far from home at a great school. I want to learn things, make friends, and party. But when Kate was on the roof, I knew I'd gone too far. Why come? Why did you come tonight? Membership dues? Don't laugh, but I had a weird vibe this might actually be the last Vortex Club party. End of the world, right? I do have to go now. Look out for yourself, Taylor. And give my best to your mom. Oh, thanks, Max. She's doing great after her surgery. I'm glad to know you're looking out for us too. She might help me with that oxygen kit. That oxygen kit might come in handy if somebody binges. So the Vortex VIPs get real alcohol at their under chips and crackers. There are no expense Vortex Club. I know Victoria is next on Nathan's hit list. Yeah. Sorry, Max. Vortex Club members only. Sorry, I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, you Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. And after I apologized to you the other day. Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh tried to kill herself in front of you. And me. Everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. I don't blame you. I don't blame you, Victoria, but... 
You know Kate had a church group and that she didn't party. So why did you send out that video? Oh, God. I swear we weren't even going to do it. Then we had some wine and got stupid. It's more than stupid. It's mean. It's hateful. Kate never did anything to you. And that didn't stop you from taking one last video of her on the roof. I deleted that from my phone. Maybe I'm not her friend, but I didn't get off on Kate attempting suicide. I'm not evil, Max. I believe you, Victoria, but I don't understand you. That makes both of us, Max. I always feel like I have to overcompensate. For what, I have no clue. I'm only here to become a photographer, not president. You do have talent. You have talent, Victoria. You don't have to push people out of your way. You don't understand. My parents own a gallery. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. No, it's, it's art. You don't have to play their way. Mr. Jefferson doesn't talk that way, and, and he's famous. On point, Max. Thanks for admitting again that I have some talent. Not that I think I always do. I don't either. That's the choice you make. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. Do you think it's like fate we're not supposed to be friends? We're not enemies. Maybe, but who says we have to be enemies? Whoever makes that decision. That would be us, Victoria. Yes. Well, Max Caulfield, I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. I don't think that's gonna happen. But not for the reasons you think. Oh, you look so serious. I'm gonna warn her. Victoria, listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know Nathan is your friend, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so he could take her someplace dark. What? Nice try, Max. But I don't believe you. And why would he do that? That I don't know yet. But it was enough to make Kate want to die. And I think you're next. Max, that is crazy. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total yeah. freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not. You have to believe me. You could have been a major bitch to me when I got hit with that paint, and I deserved it. Max, I don't hate you. I actually think you're one of the coolest people at Blackwell. Weird, but cool. You just don't know it yet. Maybe I'm jealous because you don't give a shit what anybody thinks, and I do. To be honest, Nathan has been freaking me out lately. He's not here, and I haven't seen him. Just make sure you stay away from him. And stick close to your friends tonight, okay? I let you boss me around this one time. And I have other people I can go to for protection. Yes, good, that's fine. Thanks for telling me this, Max. It's all if good. If what you said is true, then you be careful too. I've got my own protection. Um, text me if you need anything. I will. Thanks, Victoria. Au revoir. Okay, okay, good, 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 good. You been? Maybe there's hope yet for Victoria. I'm um, oh good. Chloe's here. Oh, she obviously didn't find Nathan. Nathan there you are. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the locker. Damn. Why is it he? Maybe what? he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So you made it, Max. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson. <laughs> are you both okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. I, I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He, he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the, uh, the whole 
Kate's situation. What? Yeah, that makes yeah. sense. Yeah. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost gone. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. Okay, okay, everybody calm down. Thank you, thank you. I, I appreciate it. I, look, I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. Now this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy, and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. The envelope, please. Drum the rolls! Is... Come on! Oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Oh my god! What people are booing. Oh, that's so harsh, bro. <laughs> oh my god, she's a date, but she's fucking... Thank you this is so a good stuff. much, Mr. Jefferson. It was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. Oh my God, Jefferson! And I'd like that to guy, dedicate this prize to Kate Marsh. <laughs> she is the real everyday hero of Blackwell, and I can't wait for her to come back. Thank you. You suck, Victoria. <laughs> so I said you suck. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Yes, I can. He fucking cares. Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. Bro, this is quite a long episode. This one, episode four, is quite longer than expected. Oh, that's fine, I'm enjoying myself. The last three hours have flown by. Oh Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard right now. See, that's why he should come to the police, bro. Fuck. Now there's only one. Stop stomping around, Chloe. Right. Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us. Okay. Rewind button's ready, my dude. Okay. Here. Come on, come on. Nathan needs to die now. Oh, for God's sake, Chloe, you have to be quiet. We could die, okay? Okay. Why is that owl here again? Why is it falling us? Max, when we catch Nathan, you better rewind so I can kill him over and over. Jesus, um, be quiet, okay? We have to be invisible. Hurry! Oh God, Max, look. She's still there. Don't look, Chloe. <coughs> oh, no. You got me. Game sticking. Uh, oh, is it? All oh, right. Okay. Thanks for letting me know, dude. I'll look at my side. But no! Chloe. Oh 
fucking headshot, dude. Oh my god. Uh, I'll go. Let me look at Twitch from my phone. See on what you're seeing. Oh, is it? Is it fine now? Was it? Oh, and knew it! I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. Because if Victoria's the next target. Why did Victoria win that prize? As soon as Victoria won that prize, I went, oh, fuck. Oh, my God. And so ended episode four. Holy shit, dude. Oh, man. Which means we have the finale, episode 5, next week. But that was absolutely awesome. That was so good. Right, let's look at all our decisions. I 47% ref refuse Chloe's request. I, which I did. You stopped Warren from beating up on Nathan. Most of us did that. Thank you for the stream. Oh, thank you. Oh, it's a pleasure. I'd love to see you again, um, Six. Come by anytime. Um, I try and stream every day apart from Sunday, um, best I can. Um, you'll see on the stream what we try and play on those days. Um, but thank you, and thank you so much for the follow. It's been really great having you here. Thank you for, like, um, your advice, um, having a keen interest in the game, and us connecting over that. So it's been really great. Yeah. Yes, and Akers, Akers, as you can see, is a mod. He's my friend in real life. Does all the YouTube stuff for me as well. Um, so, um, yeah. And we are, we're on a separate channel together called Post Sanity. So, check that out as well. Uh, we do a lot of tabletop RPG stuff on there. Um, but, uh, take care. I'll see you uh, next time. Um, whenever that is. Um, yeah. Oh, no, it's been a great episode today. In episode 5... Let's look at the last things before we finish up. Uh, we got no one got hurt. 67. Oh, there was Chloe killed. For, oh, there was options for that. Oh, if we had taken the gun, probably we, we would have had options. But you believe you're a warning. 65%. Okay. Right. Next. You, uh, the dark room. You let the blue Jay die. What blue Jay? Where? You didn't disturb the bird's nest. 89%. Okay, that's what I wanted to do. Uh, you found Dave's files in another way. Yep. Crowbar. Uh, Kate helped you find Nathan's room. Awesome. You made a video to Daniel to attend the Vortex Club party. 27. Oh! Oh, cool. You didn't leave a message on Warren's slate. I didn't know that was even a fucking option. You didn't figure out Nathan's pin code. Oh, no, I just... Okay, 68%. Jeez, I wonder. Only 32% have figured it out. You helped Alyssa. Of course I did. <laughs> she fucking... I have to. She keeps fucking... She can't take care of herself. Right. Exit. Next time on... So it takes her away on thingy and then never sees her again. Oh, she disappeared on the trip. It's probably what he was trying to do. Nathan's actually probably going to be the fucking hero at the end of this. That would be so fucking crazy. Polarized. Whew. Damn. Fantastic. And that's probably why he's come to our school to teach us. A Blackwell. And he probably has moved around. Yeah. That's crazy. So who is he really? If he's using Prescott's stuff. Maybe he's doing so much drugs because he's helped uh, holding string. Oh, I don't know. Crazy. Okay. Damn. Okay. Ooh. Interesting. Right, well, we'll get to know more next week then. <laughs>
Um, take care, guys. We'll be back potentially. Murder, murder, murder. <laughs> there was definitely murder in this episode. There definitely was. Um, it's Thursday tomorrow. Um, I did talk about maybe doing something else instead of Nio on a Thursday, keeping Tuesday for Nio because I might play something else. So I'm going to look into that tomorrow and have something else downloaded. So uh, keep an eye out for that. So I might play something else on a Thursday. So um, as far as I know, there's nothing stopping me playing something on Thursday because I also want to attend the Postality stream. Um, part three of chapter one of Assignment Lightborn Candelaria Obscura happening at Postality, where me and Akers um, are GMs and players. Um, as part of the role lead, that's role dash Y, Grail's tabletop series that we do on the Postality. So go check that out. That'll be um, that last installment of chapter one will be going on there. And then we have a chat on Saturday. Um, to talk about uh, Cisco is going to be there. Um, is Josh going to be there, Akers? Is Josh is Josh going to be around on Saturday? Has he talked? Have you talked to him at all? Um, and then of course Akers, I assume will be there. Um, uh, all my players. Um, I was leading the session. Um, don't own it. Ah, oh, fair enough. But at least I'm sure Akers. Uh, assuming you're going to be there, and then Cisco. So, um, yeah, we're going to talk about the game. Um, that we've been, you know, showing all three parts of uh, over the last couple of weeks. And then we're actually recording Chapter 2 on March 9th. So I'm really excited for that. And then that will be released whenever that is, based on the schedule. But before that's released, there'll be a Laser and Feelings. Uh, another Akers. Akers runs Laser and Feelings. We'll have the next episodes coming out for that. But that'll be exciting. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah, see you tomorrow. And for not Nio, something else. So keep... Keep an eye out. All right, guys. All the best and take care. Bye-bye.